What's happening, fam? James and Carlito here. Giza. We're at the gas station trying to get some gas and some food. A little Subway sandwich for um, our fishing trip today. Giza. But uh, you guys, check this fucking... Check this truck out, man! Bro, look, look at this truck, G. I mean, it is pulling the uh, camper, but this thing's huge. <laughs> Man's gonna bag it out, no problem. Bro, that's a sick truck. He's about to fill up the other side. Bro, that thing's like a big body Hummer. Thirsty, thirsty. What's that? Thirsty. How much gas does this thing take? 140 gallons. 140? Jeez. Bro, look at this truck, man. I know y'all gonna appreciate this thing. They said it was one one of four. I mean the trailer, the trailer is nice. But the truck, jeez. Let's see what the front look like right quick. big truck all right guys so i'm happy to see that truck man that made me excited because check this out when i went inside to get uh my sandwich why was the, um the lady who was making the sandwich she just wasn't too happy to be working this morning so i go back there and uh first thing i ask is like hi are you guys open to make the sandwich because it's still early it's like 8 30 in the morning so she's sitting there on her um ear pod talking to somebody right she's like we only take cards and i'm like oh that's even better thank you so she then she hits the phone and she like <sighs> walks over at her ear and she's like i'll call you back yeah, make the sandwich you know what i'm saying so then at some point she's like what kind of cheese do you want i don't know maybe one of the white ones she's like they're all white <sighs> ma'am if you don't like your job get, get out of here you pump me gas by the way so she then, um, she like mustard mayonnaise. Yes, please. Um, mayonnaise, light on the mustard. She like bet. And then, uh, bro, the truck, we gonna go with the 87. So then she's just like, um, is that all? And I'm just like, it's been a long time since I've been to Subway. Can you help me out? Is there oil and vinegar? She's like, okay. Is that all? And I'm like, what about the salt and pepper? Is that, man, come on now. But then I seen this truck, bro. And it, it, it made things a lot better. So, you know, when people in the morning, not too happy, hey, that's their problem. You know what I'm saying? We about to go fishing, catch some catfish and all that. You know what I'm saying? So y'all stay tuned. We almost there. All right, guys, so uh, it's morning time and uh, nature has called. Got that lock, user. All right, y'all, so look clean in here. Let's go ahead and uh, take care of business. Tuesday, it looks like there's a film crew over there with uh, some drone stuff. They're flying some drones. I don't know what they're filming. Charles, so we're back at the bait shop. We finna grab some beers. All right, let's see. What they got? They got the chiladas, they got Modelo, tall boys. Let's go tall camper, it's only like nine o'clock. Year. We're gonna be out there for a minute. All right. So we got three. Do you guys have night crawlers? we go with for today. Green night crawlers, they got night crawlers. Garlic scented granite. Yeah, let's go with the garlic scented night crawlers. All right, guys, so we got our blood worms. We got our beer. Yes, sir. We finna go fishing. 
look for some catfish. I see him fishing game out here too. Let's go say what's up to him. <laughs> fishing game. That's fishing game right there. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Yo. All right, guys, so we made it out onto the water, yezzer. Uh, and I'm just gonna paddle out to uh, no man's land over yonder, straight ahead. All right, guys, it's Modelo time. Yezzer, we gotta set the um, first line up. So let me set that paddle right in there so we don't lose it. Cheers, my guys. I don't know what time it is, but. So I got some, uh, what do these call garlic scented night crawlers, bro. I heard catfish like garlic. I have garlic clothes. I have them in the back of my box. I can't find them though. And I heard they like corn too. So let's go ahead and, uh, set this bait up and throw it. So we got two fishing lines and hopefully we cat. I'm looking for catfish, bro. Anything. I, I just want to catch something guys. All right, y'all. Yeah. All right, y'all. Must throw this one. Take a sip first. Hey, I think I'm just gonna drop it right here, bro. I'm not even gonna throw this. Hey, we gonna drop this and see if we get a bite. I do want to put some uh, a worm on there though. Maybe uh, two, three. I don't know. All right. Yep. There we go. Uh, maybe another one. Oh, there we go. All right, guys. So, um, you guys are probably wondering what I'm doing. I'm gonna rig my phone up for uh, IG Live. So, when you're out on the water, you gotta have be careful with everything. <laughs> so, check this out. We made a tripod for it. It's pretty much gonna sit like that, and then uh, we gonna have no problem streaming. Keep pulling, my boy. Let's go. Hey, he pulling. I ain't never caught a fish before, but bro, look, hey, bro, look at the fishing pole. Hey, look at the fishing pole, bro. He fighting. <laughs> bro, we're supposed to light up right now, G. Hold on. He still on? All right, so I thought I had a bite on that last reel, but um, I'm new to fishing. I have no clue. It could have been, could have just gotten stuck there or snagged, but. All right, guys, no bites here, so we have to uh, take our fishing poles and move on. All right. So I've had no luck here. Uh, I definitely got to take a leak. So <laughs> I'm going to move spots and go over. I don't know. that. I like the scenic area over there. It looks a little bit more like more trees and stuff, but uh, we still out here. All right, guys, so... I just moved from that last spot. <clears throat> I was probably there for, I don't know, 30 minutes. No bites. They did, uh, I think I did get a couple bites, bro. I put the corn on, the corn is gone. So I'm gonna try and put some more corn on it. But uh, I'm headed towards like the opening. So I'm gonna try and maybe fish like right over there. I figure since the water is pushing that way, maybe we got some fish flow there. It's a little bank right there. So let's go set up. Kind of right over in that area. All right, guys, it's starting to get warm out here, and I've got these this suit on. Heat's definitely getting to me, so um, I'm thinking I'm gonna probably try and go to the shore, uh, take a quick leak, and then uh, take the suit off, uh, and then come back out. All right, so let's go over there, take care of business again. You guys, check out this scenery, man. It's so nice. So nice. All right, so we're heading that direction, little beach. Take the suit off. Oh, take a leak. Oh, 
I gotta get put my Crocs on though. Oh, this water. It actually feels good. Here's some, oh, there's a little bit of beach. Whoa. Are you floating, baby? All right, you guys. I found the garlic. Oh, some bait just fell off. Damn it. Hopefully it wasn't the worm. All right, y'all. So we got the garlic with the worm. Let's throw this one out. All right, guys. Here's my uh, small jackery battery pack. So I like to carry this with me wherever I go. And uh, it's easy to... You know, got the iPhone charging right now. And then uh, we definitely got to charge the GoPro so we don't run out of battery power. Let's see if it still records if I charge it. I'm going to open the uh, little side and plug in. Let me see what happens. Yeah, so we should be good. All right. So this is how we charge the battery pack so we can keep going. All right, so the battery pack on the uh, GoPro at this point to 19% and the phone, uh, it was about 35. So while we have lunch, we charge up. All right, this is a small jackery too. It's not the big one. All right, guys, it's lunchtime. And uh, for today, I didn't want to uh, reheat anything. I took the easy way out. So we got some hot Cheetos. Open this thing up. I don't plan on eating the whole thing, the whole, uh, cause. So far guys, no fish. I got the two lines set up. Two foot or something like that. A big one. That was busting. You ever do this? This this is like struggle meal. I'm out here on the lake. We need to get as many calories as possible. We in survival mode. All right, y'all. So I thought I wasn't gonna eat the second one, but I might as well eat it. I think it's the smaller half of the portion. The sandwich is busting. Uh, and I don't want it to be in my, you know, it's it's warm out today, bro. So let's go ahead and pack this thing with some hot Cheetos, bro. You ever do this? Not that, not from the get-go. There we go. Yeah, buddy. <sighs> bro, this sandwich is honestly perfect. All right, y'all, we recharged the uh, battery. So uh, let's go on out. We still haven't caught anything, so we just got to change, change spots, man. Let's go out in the middle of the uh, lake and see if we can get anything over there. All right, guys, still no fish. Definitely warm out here. Got the two, uh, got the two lines out, so let's hope we catch something right over there. And that's where we had lunch and charged up the battery. By the way, guys, uh, blooper. So this is the GoPro I'm using. And uh, on the side of the GoPro, there's a little levy, little door. Remember I told you guys I was going to char I was gonna charge the uh, GoPro. So when you charge the GoPro and you want to record, you have to pop the door off. Little door, little side door. Bro, why did I pop the door off? And, you know, when it was time to leave, I was careless and just started moving stuff around. And now this door is missing. So hopefully... The camera doesn't get wet because if it gets wet, it's over. You know what I mean? It just can't get in there. But uh, I'm going to Amazon right now and order up. Uh, uh, so hopefully it doesn't look too foggy. Does it look foggy, guys? Pulling. We beached up at another beach. I'm still full from the sandwich. And I got a Gatorade left, so we still have some fluid Gatorade and a bottle of water. So we should be good. 
for like another hour or something. Come on, man. We need something to bite. All right, you guys. Still no luck. Ah. So uh, it's getting warm out here. Let's go take a dip. Gizzard. Explore the lake and explore the lake and you know uh, know all, all, all of its points. So right now I'm at a different beach and um, we probably gonna end alive, not the live. We probably gonna end the uh, the vlog soon. Uh, sun's still up, still warm, still cool, but you guys still it's it's uh I'm still learning <laughs> and. Uh, it's not easy out here. So, more tries to come, and uh, we just gotta keep going. You know, hopefully this weekend, maybe I'll try a, a, a ocean fishing, but um, we'll see what's up. But anyways, I'll keep you guys posted on uh, what what's going on. I'm gonna probably hang out here for like, I don't know, the 45 minutes. We made it back to the dock, empty-handed. No fish for today, man. Uh, I wasn't recording today when, uh, my real bro. So I'm gonna have to go. This was like a little cheap one. I got some more at home, so I'll swap these out. But um, for the most part, fam, still out here learning. Took another L, but uh, I got to explore the lake. You know what I mean? I got to, I was definitely moving around. You know, if you think I was not moving around, I definitely, I think I was at three or different, uh, three or four different beaches. All right, guys, we got some good news. I was just leaving and uh, met this dude on dock. He said they just stalked the lake. With some trout let's see what's happening we about to throw one of these bad boys in yizzer tried my best apparently they restocked the lake with some trout today uh so hey we might try and hit this up tomorrow so took an l on the fishing but a great time on the outdoors so let's get it win-win yizzer